This is the quick overview of the JO filament dryer. It is identical to the Sunlu S1 dryer. In fact, if you uh, look down the bottom, you will see that there is a sticker for Sunlu. Now, because it is identical to the Sunlu, the problems are exactly the same. First, you have the temperature sensor. It was under the heating pad, so I had to move the heating sensor away. Next, there was no fan, so I had to connect the fan to the uh, power core. I think at first you'll see plenty of designs where they have the fan mounted up here. I find that that's unnecessary, so I just put it there. It's laying there freestyle, free newly. It doesn't get in the way of the filaments at all. There's a nice mod video that will show you everything. I thought that the guy did a pretty good job, so I'm not going to do a video on it. I'll put the link down at the bottom below. You put the uh, filaments in. And then press any button to turn it on. I have mine removed because I'm still modding the, uh, the, the dryer. Now, if you have the fan added in, like mine, once you plug the power core into the wall, the fan will start running immediately, even though the heater is not on, but the fan is running. So what I used was this plug, power plug. I can manually force it to be off or on. There we go. So when I'm, whatever I need to uh, start the machine, I just press it to turn on, the fan kicks in, press the buttons here to turn on the unit and it will start working. The maximum that the temperature goes up is 55. And you can press, there's two values, there's the PV which is present value and then SV which is selected value which is the value that you want. So say if I want 55, I'll just jump this up, jack it up to 55, and then wait for the PV to go up. Usually the PV starts at room temperature, so that's about 25 Celsius. Everything is here is Celsius, by the way. If you're going to do PE, TG, it will, go, it will need to go up to 65, but unfortunately this stays maximum at 55 as I mentioned before. It can go lower but it cannot go higher than 55. Alright, hope this video helps you in your 3D printing adventures. If you have any questions feel free to let me know in the comment section.